just like we do on this side of the house. Question number 10, Greg O'Connor. Uh, my question is to the Minister of Police. What support is the government providing to help the police improve their digital connections with the public? The Honourable Stuart Nash. Mr Speaker, off the back of the single biggest investment in our police service through Budget 2018, this week I was pleased to open the new Police Digital Services and Communication Centre in Kapiti. The specialist service made possible by this new facility signal a transformation in the way police connect with the public. For example, the centre or she received the majority of the over one million non-urgent calls made to police stations around the country. It will employ 200 people once training process is complete. I would like to acknowledge the work of the local MP, the Honourable Chris Farfoy, the local Pororua and Kapiti councils for their commitment to helping us build safer and more connected communities. What other capital investment projects has the government funded to support safer and more connected communities? Mr Speaker, under the previous government, 150 front, uh, front counters were closed due to health and safety concerns for staff or because of difficulties with public access. I am pleased to report that 82 of those sites, including Kawakawa in the far north and Mosgiel in the deep south, have now been refurbished, upgraded and reopened. Work is underway for the remaining 68 sites, including, Mr Speaker, the Lower Hut Station and two sites in Tauranga to be completed by early 2019. Thank you. How is this improved police presence reflected in our provinces and regions and in smaller centres? Mr Speaker, this government is a champion of the regions in so many ways. For example, members are already aware that Northern will see a 25 per cent increase in the number of constables we allocate out of the extra 1,800 police. In that district alone, new capital investment has allowed for upgrades to police sites in Dargaville, Kawakawa, Kaihoi, Kamo, Paihia and Monganui. Work is also underway on other northern sites in Kaitaia, Ruakaka, Kirikiri, Russell and Ohenira. This government is committed to investing in healthier, safer and more connected communities. Even with a minister who defines himself as elderly, apparently. Um, question number 11, the Honourable Louise Upston. Thank you, Mr Speaker. 